A super special shout out to all my amazing members and patrons for going above and beyond in supporting the channel. If you want to join them, consider becoming a patron. The link as well as the associated perks are in the description down below. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Darkness Falls Mod. So as you guys can see, I have made myself some chicken coops of here. Uh, unfortunately, that one death really, really set us back. I think we are even at Queen on us. Um, I want to go and see if we can't go and make ourselves the last two classes. Although I do want the mastery class for mechanic over here. Because if you do that, uh, look at all this. It unlocks the oil pump, SMG, titanium club, titanium stage hammer, car battery, engine, gyrocopter, box truck. That thing has a ton of storage. Buggy, nice and fast. Humvee, stallion, and marauder recipes. Uh, increases the crafting tier by 10 for clubs and sledges, salvage tools, SMGs, robotic turret, and junk turret. So yeah, we have to also make ourselves the robotic turret of here. But I put the one point that we just had into the severe. So now our stealth assassin is 5 out of 5. Increase sneak movement speed by 50%. Sneak attacks do an extra 200% damage. Action make, uh, actions make 25% less noise. Trash no longer makes noise when stepped on. So now hopefully we'll be able to stealth a little bit better. What I actually want to do first before we do anything else today is we need to fix this. Um, I actually want to also go and just fix this walkway over here. This is not supposed to be like this. Last time we saw that uh, having it like this, the, the behemoth, the honor, oh the titan, was actually able to make it over so easily. So we're going to do this. We're going to just go and upgrade this. Technically, we should actually have some bars over here that we can just scoot through. And then if something comes through, we can just stand over here and shoot. Uh, that means this also needs to be concrete if I do something like that. Do this. So it's, it's annoying for us having to crouch out and in like this the whole time. But at the same time, it's going to help us a lot. I almost keep forgetting that this is not Ravenhurst. <laughs> in Ravenhurst, you have to, uh, when you're placing stuff, you can't jump in place. But yeah, you can jump in place all you like. Okay, I also bought 550 stone from the trader and made a ton of cobble. So we should be able to just get this done. Uh, basically, I want to make this window over here in such a way where I can see the demons and shoot at them and stuff without them really spotting me too easily. I mean, look at all the damage over here. This is just because the demons can see us that well. Put that over there, put that over there. I have to make a ladder that comes over here, otherwise the zombies will think, nope, can't do it, so let's just attack anything. If you don't put this ladder up over here, it's going to cause problems later. I also want to take out this whole walkway, actually. There shouldn't be a walkway here at all. But, uh, it's all wood, or concrete and stuff. It's going to be take a while to actually break all of that out. Uh, I should also put a hatch over here. But if some uh, zombie whatever breaks through, or if I see ooh, a zombie is breaking through, we just go like this. We go like this, and over here, we just do this. So I should put a block over here so I can just copy the rotation. And then basically, as long as, long as you put it over, over here, you can just stand on top of the zombie and shoot down at their heads. And just a nice way to deal with the zombies without them seeing you the whole time. This wall still needs to go all the way around. There's still so much work to be done over here. I haven't seen a wandering ward in a while, so that actually really terrifies me at the moment. Can we make augers? Yeah, okay. See, I'm tempted to go mining during the night with an auger. Um, I don't know which is going to be faster, the pick or the auger. I mean, now, the, the auger, definitely. But we had a titanium pick, so that thing was doing way more damage. Just make sure all of this is kind of repaired. The pillar downstairs actually really bothers me or worries me at the moment. Because that pillar is just concrete, so... No, is that... Is it? No, it's cobble. So if that goes, this whole defense goes. So far, the zombies haven't really aggroed. They take this uh, They take this walkway really nicely, so that's awesome. My senses have picked up something. It's a shame... Uh, do we have a sledge? And how far does the sledge pick up? If I stand over there and I put the sledge over here, will it knock zombies down? The goal of this defense is more to knock zombies down than anything else. You have to be careful. There's no wandering ward at the moment. I want to fix the damage that one dude uh, did over here. It was a hazmat zombie that exploded. Go do that. Go do that. Um, do that. And then I technically want to put some ladders in as well. Although I don't really like the idea of ladders. But uh, it's also going to stop the zombies from just smacking everything. Unless I just make the walkway wider. But basically, I need to make sure that they get up. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Even though this is a waste of concrete blocks, I'm going to go and make stairs. Because if the zombies make it up easier, they're not going to get stuck on top of each other too easily as well. Damn, they did so much damage over here. Look at this. 
Copy shape, copy rotation, and repair. Okay, so for today, I actually want to go to Eve's place because we need to keep uh, doing the quest as well. Uh, we did the test last time. Any concrete mix right now. Yeah, we did the test last time, so now all we need to go and do is grab the rest of the stuff. Um, I have no idea how we're going to do the small bunker. I know that the small bunker, the stairs, can be smacked out. But if you make too much noise, screamers will show up. Oh, which reminds me, we have to make turrets still. If I can make myself one or two turrets, like really cool, really good turrets, they might actually help us with all we need. I uh, also want to go block off that hole they made at the back. Not that it's really going to help, because this is now a massive vulnerability over here. The moment there's a hole over here, they're going to take advantage of it. I've basically also gone and detached this from the trader. And inside the trader himself, I'm also detached this. I don't think there's another way up. Except perhaps over here. So I'll need to remove that as well so I don't feel like there's a way to get to the trade over here. Okay, you... We don't have any cash right now, but you don't really sell anything. We need way more notes as well, so if we see more bookstores, definitely we're going to go for those. I only do business with oh, I, I spent all my cash. I can't even buy the oil shale from him. We need that, uh, that mechanic mastery. At the moment, we're really, really struggling with that. Can we make... Uh, no, we don't have the mastery yet for this one. See, if we had this one, you can make the unlock... Oh, yeah, yeah, we have to get this one as well. Large backpack, mega crush. So, uh, that's the recipe for it. Signal flare, that thing calls in uh, airdrops. Only problem is, obviously, especially on insane difficulty, we're going to be calling in a lot of demons and stuff. If it wasn't for that, then that would be perfect just now. Okay, I'm also going to go and just do this. For those who don't know, basically... Oh, wait, uh, do this, do this. This stops zombies from jumping over your walls. Basically, if they try and jump on top of each other's heads, they get pushed back. This walkway over here, I could actually also make nice and thin. I don't have to happen to this wide. Do this. I want to be able to stand over here. Like so, and just snipe them. I need to block off that side so I can just see them on the floor and snipe. At the moment, every time they see me from a weird angle, they break this whole defense of ours. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I, I need to go for Eve. And then we also have to do a ton of scout quests. If we can complete, like, a really big amount of scout quests and get some dig quests as well. Oh, which reminds me. That was also a big loss. We should actually make a few of these so we don't have to constantly make them. So, electrical parts. Scrap polymers and forged iron. I think we have a ton of forged iron. Yep. <laughs> Shame. There's the only stuff in that box. Okay, so, yeah, for the tablets, I'm actually going to make a few of them. So if we die, we have a few. This allows you to scan and stuff. It's really, really, really important to have that. Um, to do the scout quest, I'm just going to take a whole stack of this with me. And that should be it. Oh, I also have to make the auto loader still. Auto loader. But unfortunately, we don't have enough uh, blue notes. For those of you who don't know, the auto loader allows you to sh fire like five shots instead of uh, just one shot with your uh, crossbow. So instead of having to shoot, reload. Shoot, you can actually shoot five times. That's awesome. Also, I have to make sure I have all my ammo over here. I think I can actually unpack these and make... Yeah, we just need feathers. I can unpack these and make myself some normal ones. Although I don't know if we actually have this recipe yet. Let's just see. We do that. Do this. Please tell me we have the recipe. Yes! Steel crossbow bolts. We're going to go for this one. And we need way more sticks as well. No, yeah. We have it over here. Boom. The steel crossbow bolts just do so much more damage. That's why I like or prefer using them. Okay, but yeah. Basically, I made these chicken coops over here. Uh, only feathers. That's still busy. Still busy. Eggs. I want to wait until there's two options because now you can go... Oh, crap. I did it too slow. It's a wandering horde. It's the Wandering Horde. I saw you. I want to shoot, but they're standing too close, so I'm going to call too much attention. We also don't have a scope right now, which makes this a lot harder. Is she a demon or something? Okay, they're actually going for the defensive here. Yeah? Or 
already have some zombies just going up. Yep. Hello. Any vomiters? Make sure there's no vomiters. This also does more damage against demons, but I wonder if it counts for this dude as well. But I need a sc Oh, hello. Nope, 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 nope. I saw you. Yeah, okay. I need to quickly do this. I need to do this and do this. Reload. Did he just break a block? To be careful of that demon when I can vomit. Do this. Do this. Without the scope, this makes it so much harder. Okay, I think there might be some more somewhere. Oh, they broke through. They actually Master, broke through at the back. Alone. Okay, yeah, so um, this base is failing. Just because of that one dude that uh, got in last time. Oh no, he destroyed that ladder, so they might not be able to get it up. Where did you go just now? Hello? I need him to jump out so I can actually deal with the rest of the zombies. Oh, they're inside Razor's place already. Can't believe they already got in. After all that hard work of just trying to make sure they don't get in. Unless they're still stuck downstairs, hopefully. Technically, I want them to break Razor's place. Uh Oh, yes, 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 yes. You're pathing the right way, you beauty. I have to do that. I have to be careful of the other titan down there not being clever enough to climb the ladder here quickly. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to stop the healing of the demons. And then to kill them. Come on. Okay, my goal right now is just to get the, the vomiters and then I have to get the titans over here. There's a few zombies inside. Hopefully they don't kill the dude. Although he should be safe. I shot him once. Now I just have to hit him in the face. Where is he? He should stop healing because I hit him already with the other thing. Nope. Oh, he's already healing again. Damn it. Okay. Is there any other vomitors inside this group right now? I think there's a hazmat over there. But as long as we just for now focus on these guys, we should be okay. If I hear the whoop whoop sound, we know we have to be uh, focus on them. Holy shit, where did you come from? Where did he come from just now? I'm so... Oh, okay, you must have made it over. Okay, so yeah, luckily I was underneath that thing, but we need a scope over here. Unfortunately, without the scope, this makes it so much harder. Probably see if I can't get the demon first. Where is the hazmat dude? Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Oh crap, he's gonna- Oh yeah, he keep, they keep doing that. They explode on their friends over there and then I get nothing. 
Yeah, guys, this is so difficult without a scope. I wonder if I shouldn't try with this one. I think I'm gonna get a screamer this way. Yeah, this is no way to kill him. Um, damn, I have to figure out a way. I need some XP right now. I don't think we have any other mods or any other... Yeah, we don't. I need a scope from another uh, gun, but I think we don't have any other scopes. This is so much finer aiming if you have to do it this way compared to if you use an actual scope. Now that dude, as long as he doesn't make it over, he's my biggest threat. And I have to be careful of, of behind me, because I know there's one inside as well. Yes! I think he I actually lost track of me for a second there. That's why I was able to do some sneak damage. 200%, baby! See, I could throw a grenade over there, but that's going to definitely call in a screamer. Hello? I've got a bad feeling about this. How did you lose your legs, lady? I'm so tempted to just throw some grenades there, down there. Wait until there's a nice big stack, throw a ton of them and just chain them. I wonder if I had to stand on the wall and be closer, would I be in danger over there? What? Well, what just pushed me off? I thought I just got pushed off. Okay, we have to be careful. I think there's still a titan on the inside. I must have just taken a step off without realizing it. That was dangerous. It's a shame. It seems that these zombies are almost like feral scents. If I could just run away without them realizing it and stealth them from a distance when they uh, get confused, you'd be able to kill all of them. My whole body's putting skew just to aim for these guys. Oh shit. No. I have to be careful of that uh, behemoth or that titan underneath. I was trying to be clever by jumping to the side, but that did not work. I need way more ammo. Let's just do that. Um, I should probably also try the Molotovs. I haven't used them in a while. It doesn't really work at the moment, but at least it sh I should kill all the small fry a little bit. Master, we are not alone. <laughs> I hear another vulture above me. Oh, we don't even have an anti-rad mod on, so the fire is doing damage, but not really a lot. If we had the anti-rad mod on, it actually, actually, it'll bleed them out, and uh, because they're on fire, and uh, yeah, they don't heal themselves as they bleed. This is so much harder without a uh, scope. Unfortunately, I, I don't think we have the resources for a scope right now, do we? Should probably check. Scope. Oh. Yeah, it needs blue notes. We only have uh, two. That is unfortunate. Okay, if we can kill the demons one by one, that's going to be awesome. I'm just hoping it's not going to take the whole episode just to kill these. I need the I need the loot from there. That's why I'm taking my chances with this. As you guys know, sometimes the loot inside these bags are insane. And since we don't face any horde knights of our own, we have to kill as many of these as possible. Hang on, man. I think I should hit the demon before they even fall on the ground. And it's easier to actually get it done. I need I've to knock them down easier as well. This. I don't know how they make it in. That should not have been possible just now. How did she make it inside? Where are you? Did she just jump this? I hope she uh, jumped the side just now. At this rate, we're definitely going to get a wandering ward or scream ward, I think. I think I'm just going to have to run away. Even though I need these kills. I'm not, without a scope, I'm just not doing enough damage. Your aim has to be pinpoint accurate.
What if I shouldn't just do this? I definitely killed some of them. Now I have to be careful of the screamer. Come on, get knocked down. The thing is, if they're running around, especially with this um, sniper, it's really, really hard hitting them. My senses have picked up something. But if I can knock them down like that, it's easier hitting them when they're down like that. Okay, that actually did the trick. That thinned them out quite a bit. But like I said, now we have to be careful of that screamer because that made too much noise. I get you. Come on, demon lady. Oh, come on. I almost had a... I hit her again so she's not healing. See, because it's insane difficulty, you have to go for those headshots. The moment you miss one headshot, it's just they're too fast. There you go. I think after this, we should actually focus on some scout gears. I know I said we have to go to Eve as well, but we need better gear. This shows me we need way, way, way better gear. We can't even kill these guys. I also have to make sure that the Titans and stuff aren't still inside the building. That's going to be another challenge. You think you're done, all of a sudden you have to still deal with those. Where are you going? Wait, how? Master, we are not alone. Okay, so they made a way through the house. Oh, yes! We have a laser multi-tool. Just realized. Um, that's not good. They made a way somehow through the trader. Through Razor over here to be able to get to us. Okay, now we just have to deal with the bloody titan inside. I have no idea how, though. Oh, there's still so many titans over here. What? How many titans are there? That's just insane. Now, okay, now we have to try and see if we can't kill them. On the one hand, uh, we don't have to kill them. But on the other hand, if I can kill them, they should drop some really good bags. Just drop some awesome stuff over here. We don't want to drop or lose all of the stuff. And they made a nice big hole in the wall, of course. Because I was so busy smacking the zombies in front, or trying to hit them, these were able to make a big hole. Oh, they're definitely breaking in somewhere. My senses have picked up something. See, if I'm not careful, before I realize that there's gonna be a zombie on uh, top of my head over here. At least I, make, I made silences for these, so I, I'm not making as much noise as I would have. I have to figure out how they made it upstairs as well. It seems that one gap that I made wasn't enough. Come on, John, you can do it. There's also a vulture playing around. If that thing comes for us right, then we're screwed. Okay, now we can go for headshots. The problem is he's sticking his head into the wall. There you go. There you go. Come on. Show me your pretty, pretty little head. I didn't even pay attention to the time. Uh, the next ward, I'm just running away. They've already done too much damage over here for us to fix this. 
If I can make sure that uh, his base and our base isn't even connected, that's all we need right now. Lovely little lady, you're next. Come on. Now, I have no idea whether that was it. Is there more? Or is that it? Oh, there's another one of you. Hello. How many of you guys are there? The bags in front are going to start despawning because of the amount of zombies that I have to kill. Come on. Also have to repair these guns now because I've been killing too much. The durability is super, super low. Okay, so, um, yeah. Let me just make sure we are safe. Out of stamina completely. Damn. Yeah, we're going to go out and have some fun now, guys. Uh, that was just... Yeah, that took, <laughs> that took forever. But hopefully that means all of them are dead now. That was way too many titans. I think I hear footsteps somewhere, so I need to be careful. Hello, lady. You can see they're actually breaking into the wall of here, which is bad. Oh, yes, two skill points. If we can get 10 skill points like that without putting our own points in, we can go for the mastery class of um, the, the mechanic. Please, I need more mastery books. Mastery points. I need these. Come on. Was that just lucky? Oh, the titans and uh, behemoths might have them. That is a titanium auger. And... Oh, if I die with these on, I'm going to be so mad. Those are the rarest losses in Darkness Falls. That's basically, you can, I think you can actually get like a third reward now when doing quests for the trader. If I lose that, I'm going to be so upset. So I'm going to play it even more careful now because I know that those losses are so expensive. So valuable. Okay, yeah, uh, so that alone just made it super, super worth it. Well, well, another survivor. Dude, how do you survive this? Yes, third one. Another sledge. Another spear. Okay, not bad. Some, uh, some really decent loot, actually. Actually, if I jump down in, there's another one. Oh, yes! It's like the game wants me to put some points into the mechanic class. The fact that they made a massive hole of here now is really, really bad for us. And I think, yeah, they're using this to climb. I didn't think about that. I was just uh, making sure they couldn't use the other side. Um, if they can get on the wall of here, it's all over. So I need to remove this whole section of here. It's a shame the fire mod isn't a thing in Darkness Falls. I mean, obviously, if you have a wooden base and you get demon fireballs, everything's going to burn. But if you could actually just make sure everything over here that you don't want burns down, that would help so much. Yeah, how many skill points do we have? One. Plus these four is five. If I can just save up more, five more and just put the points in. I know it's expensive putting points in instead of just making it. But we just don't have the time for and, and resources right now. Sometimes if you click fast enough, you can actually get like multiple. It doesn't seem to be working right now. I think it's mostly on servers where there's a slight delay. If you click fast enough, it actually pops back into view and you can get more. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I'll have to go into god mode because I am stuck over here now. Um... Okay, uh, let me just see if I can't log out quickly. Yeah, some error just popped up and I try and go up there. Uh, that's bad. I could easily get killed now because of the zombies just standing around me. Okay, see, this is really, really bad. If that just happened while there was a zombie around me, we'd die and lose everything. I'm going to try that one more time and see if this road is just bugged. If it is, we'll just take a different road. I also need to see if we can't go and get some more fuel because we are super, super low right now. That's why if we can get more skill points... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We can make the generic notes. Generic. You can make these. Why didn't I think about that yet? I know it's expensive because we need the classes, but if we can make I've those... I think it's 60 notes it. inside the desk. So I might be able to make four or five and then we can get the mechanic mastery. Then we'll be able to get fuel because we are super, super low on fuel. I can't believe I didn't think of this at all. Damn. Right over there. So we just dig down over here. 
And since we now have the crowbar on us, we can actually get out of here faster. So we're going to make ourselves a hole. And do this. Just make sure we can get out. I have to be careful of my stamina right now. The drone's kind of in the way. So you just go and you do a power attack over here. You pick it up. But just be careful. You might actually spawn in uh, screamers if you do that. Okay, there's some cats over there. We have to be careful. Our stamina is so low. Because... Of, oh, it's over there. Our stamina is at the moment really, really, really low because of this biome. Because we're um, getting hypothermia. But just using stamina like this is really, really bad for us. Drone, please. Okay, we do that. We do that. Okay, please tell me you have some food or something. I'm really starving right now. Oh, clay, yes. Bone, yes. Sell that, sell that. I know we might need the stuff later for the storage containers. But for now, I'm more interested in resources because I need to build and repair my base. Okay, it doesn't seem to be have anything over uh, anything else over here. Um, damn, that's unfortunate. Any more explosives? Crossbow bolts? Yeah. Oh no, 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 that's too expensive. Okay, but yeah, we have to get out of here. In six minutes, you might get a wandering horde, and because I'm so slow, we can't even get back to the vehicle quickly. Imagine being here, being this slow and the Wandering Horde just coming through. That would be really, really bad for us right now. My senses you know have picked Yeah, up let's something. just do this just in case. You never ever know. Especially with my bad luck. Come on, come on, come on, where are you? We just have to go to Eve's place quickly and just accept that second quest of hers. We've done the test. Although I don't know if we're going to have enough fuel to be able to get to her because we only have 15%. I wonder if I shouldn't go back to tra uh, Trader Razor first. See if we can't make those generic notes. And if you have the generic notes, then we go and go to uh, Eve. Because if we can get those generic notes, we just have to make five, I think. Yeah, we just need five. Then we can buy the master uh, class for the... Or the mastery of the, the mechanic class. Uh, we can make ourselves fuel by putting wood inside that oil pump. And then as soon as we have all the fuel we want, we can just keep filling this vehicle up. At the moment, it's going to be way too dangerous running out of fuel in the middle of the snow biome. Especially with how low our food and drink is right now. I just realized something that should have been... Duh. Um, I, I need to remove this over here so the zombies can't stand here. But as well, this mustn't touch the floor. Why was that touching the floor? If that can touch the floor, the zombies see... Oh, they can path up the ladder over here. So if they break in, they can just climb this. But if this isn't here... Like I take that out at the bottom over there. Then they're going to jump over the walls to go for the stairs over there. Why did I not do that? That's just common sense, but for some reason, sometimes it seems... Yeah, common sense is rare. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to make some ink quickly. Honey? Ooh, do we have honey? Drone, please move. Ooh, only for four inks. That's unfortunate. And then we do at least have a lot of eggs. Now we just need a few things. Okay, so if I take... All of this. I should be able to see what I can make that. And then also this. Although I think I'm going to need more plant fibers. Ink, which one's cheaper? I'm going to run out of blueberries. Didn't I have any tomatoes? Oh, I don't have enough. The tomato recipe is the cheapest one. So I need to see if I can't get some tomatoes. I've been driving past them a lot. But just not picking them up. So we have to make sure we continuously from now on when we drive past them. Just pick them up quickly. And then if we can make our own notes that way, that will be amazing. So our goal for now, guys, is to quest. Do those tier 4 quests. And we have to get 10 points so we can go for the mastery class over here. The moment we have the mastery class, we can get the oil pump and then we can get fuel. At the moment, my fuel is insanely low. Just because, uh, yeah, we, we're not wrenching enough. Although it's so bloody dangerous to go out and wrench that uh, that's why I'm just mostly staying inside. But yeah, if you guys liked this episode, please like it to your friends. Comments, tips, and feedback, leave them down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time for some more Darkness Falls Insanity. Members and patrons get shoutouts in all of my videos, get access to a private members-only Discord channel, and as a thank you for supporting the channel, get access to my seminars that I server. If interested, check out the links in the description down below.